Hello, hello, hello. You're welcome to another episode of Kenny Songwriting and Music World. My name is Kenny, aka Kenny Wright. I'm so excited to be back again. Let's get started. You're probably wondering what is it about the blog title for today? My crappy mood song. Yeah, it's what it is. I was in a crappy mood when I wrote this song and each time I listen back to this song, I still have a big laugh. I'm thinking, Whoa, was I really this upset when I wrote this song? We'll get to that um, very soon. So the title of this song is Racing Driver. And I wrote the song 2008 and produced it the same year. It was um, produced by Paul Miles, Select Studio and the vocal performance was um, done by a lady that I really love her vocals, Gemma Wedderborn. Shout out to you, Gemma. Do you ever have this feeling where <clears throat> you have people um, who are close proximity to you, people close to you who you, you can't necessarily get away from, and they're there, you know, on your neck, on your nerve, constantly putting you off and annoying you? you do you know that feeling? It could be anybody, trust me. It could be, uh, you know, anyone close to you and you can't necessarily get away from it. And, and that was, this was what I felt at that time. I had um, one person, no, not one, actually two people at that time who were constantly always on my nerve. And I was always finding ways to deal with it, you know, cause I couldn't get away from them. One of them was, um, my old boss in, in one of my earliest jobs that I did and she was super super so overbearing she would snigger and bicker and everything all day you know someone you wake up and you have to see every day there was no getting away from her I was so frustrated and I'll wake up in every morning and go on my knees and say Oh Lord, help me not to wring someone's neck this morning. And I get to work and I'm like, Kenny, deep breath, deep breath. It didn't work for me most of the time, the deep breath thingy. Does it work for you? <laughs> so on this particular day, I had these two guys on my nerve again. It was so bad. I, I felt so overwhelmed. I, I, I barely managed to get through the day and I just kept telling God, oh, please, Lord, I don't want to fly off the handle. I don't want to lose my call. And so I managed to get through the day. I, I went home that evening. And as soon as I got through the door, I just went straight to my room and shut my door. I didn't want to transfer my aggression. And then I grabbed my book. I thought, what do I do? What do I do? And yeah, I told you music, songwriting is therapeutic for me. And it was a way of relief. The way I felt that day, was like I was a passenger in a racing car and I had a racing driver right beside me, driving me at the maximum speed round and round and round and making me go dizzy and crazy. And that was what I wrote down. I, I, I just put down all my feelings in this song. And yeah, I wrote this song within an hour, lyrics plus melody, trust me. When I'm upset, I do things really, really quickly. Like if, I'm, if, if I had a stack of um, plates in a zinc, that would normally take me 15 minutes to wash up. When I'm angry, I'd wash it up in, in five minutes. And so that was the feeling. I wrote the song so quickly. And, and now, you know, when I listen to it, it just makes me laugh. Yeah, so um, let's go into the track section right now. You're probably going to listen and have a laugh too. Alright, 
let's be real. Now you gotta give me breath or it's gonna be a tit for time. It's gonna be a tit for time. Where's the driver driving me crazy? Stuck in this car right next to you. Oh, can you handle the truth? Truth is, truth is, truth is. You're driving me to a frenzy and it's making me so dizzy. Step on the brakes and let me out. I need some air around. This change ever come when wrong deeps keep being just a fight. If it's gonna be all about you, 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 I'll find some way to go out of you. I just hope it don't hurt anymore. I need you to slow down, slow down. Racing, 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 driver. Demanding for me respect. You best that I be decent. Just like they can to be when you're always on my nerves. Okay, here's the deal. First, you gotta treat me right, cause what you give is what you get. What you give is what you get. Where's the driver? Driving me crazy, stuck in this car right next to you. Oh, can you handle the truth? Truth is, truth is, truth is. You're driving me to a frenzy, and it's making me so dizzy. Step on the brakes and let me out. I need some air around. Shout, 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 shout. Driver, driving me crazy, stuck in this car right next to you. Oh, can you handle the truth? Truth is, truth is, truth is. You're driving me to a frenzy. So, how did that go? Did you enjoy it, or did you? What were you? Did you feel shocked about it? Did you go, ooh, yeah? So, who's the racing driver in your life driving you crazy? Big sis, little bro, parents, hobby, wifey. There's definitely a way to deal with anger. Mine is pouring it into my songwriting. So yeah, do something about it. You can't necessarily get away from people. Close people are knowing you. Go jogging, take a run, hit the gym, write a song. Probably, you will probably be a better songwriter than me. So we've come to the end of this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you liked it. If you like the song, yeah, as crappy as it is, download the link right here at the bottom of the page. Join me, follow me on Twitter and subscribe to my channel. Until I see you in another two weeks, have fun! Let's be real.